What's good, YouTube? I'm about to be showing y'all the best point guard build for 2K21. Y'all know the demo just dropped yesterday, so I'm about to be showing y'all. Let's go. So the position you choose is point guard off the rip. And that's when you're going to choose right. any hand. I choose right hand. You know, I'm going to go with number four. The best number. So then, it's like my always with third from 2K20. It's the same pot chart. Half play making, half shooting. Uh, yeah, you're going to go with this pot chart. Half play making, half shooting. So that you can dribble and shoot. Basically, that's, that's all we need to do. So you're going to choose the first physical profile. So you can have the most speed. So we got 87 speed, but when we get when we upgrade, we're going to be having like a 90 or something like that. And then plus the Gatorade thing. So you're going to max out driving layup, driving dunk, and get close shot. And then you're going to max out standing dunk. I know y'all like, well, you don't need standing dunk like that. But look, I'm doing it so we can get the finishing badges. And you're going to upgrade. Uh, you're supposed to look to a 37. You're going to max out everything at shooting. And then you're going to put the post fade to a 78. So that you can get 25 shooting badges. And then for playmaking, you're going to max out pass accuracy and ball handle. You're going to put the post moves to a 43. Yeah, you want to take it down to a 43 so that you can have 21 playmaking badges. And you're going to max out perimeter defense, lateral quickness, and still going to max all that out. So you get full finishing, 25 shooting, 21 playmaking, and one defense. That's all you need. And the uh, attributes, defense attributes, that's going to make up for the one defensive badge. So you can choose any body type. I chose compact. And then the height you can choose. You can choose 6'4 or 6'3. It don't matter. But I went with 6'3. I do lowest weight. Lowest wingspan. So you see all, I get plus on all them attributes. Ball handle, 3 point, all that. So I, then I chose shot create and take. But you can choose either shot. I recommend shot playmaking or shot creating, but I went with shot creating and take over just because I don't feel like you really need slash and take for real. Uh, then I made a playmaking shot creator. It's similar to do Steve Nash, Trey Young, and Jamal Murray. So now I'm about to show y'all the uh, the badges y'all can put on this build. So I'm just uh, put the overall rate in the 99. Y'all see how the attributes was looking. Y'all can pause if y'all want. I'm a, uh, you gonna put contact finish at gold, pro touch brown. Next. Ranged in the Hall of Fame, off the rip. You get 25 shooting badges. Hot Zone Hunter Hall of Fame, Dead Out Hall of Fame, Green Machine Hall of Fame. Volume Shoot, I'ma put that on, uh, yeah, I'ma put that on, I put Volume Shoot on Gold. Then I'ma put Difficult Shots on Gold. And then, I'ma, I got, yeah, yeah, one more left. I'ma just throw it on. Yeah, you, you can uh, put on Hot Start like that if y'all want to. Or you can do that, or you can put Volume Shoot Hall of Fame. Or you could put clutch shooter hall of fame and put volume shooter on silver but that's how this how i want my badges all right so playmaking out uh, the rip choose a quick first step hall of fame unpluggable hall of fame only if it worked this year because i'm gonna change my badges around depending because last year unpluggable didn't work at all so you can put handles for days hall of fame stop and go on bronze space creator i'm put that on hall of fame I'm put tight handles on like gold I ain't never used angle breaker last year and I still used to get angle breakers all the time. So I'm putting bail out on bronze. So the one defensive badge, intimidator. Like always, cause ain't nothing else to put it on. Yeah, I'm gonna press continue. So that's the bill. If this helped y'all, like, comment, and subscribe. It is what it is. It is what it is. <laughs>